What's going on guys? We're back. We're steady streaming Casios. Yes, we took a week off for Thanksgiving. We hope you had a great Thanksgiving. Yay too much. You sat on the couch, took a big nap. Um, that's what it's for, right? But we have still been working on this Airstream. This is this 1964 Airstream Overlander. If you watched our last video, you saw that we built a gantry in order for me to lift the shell um, so that I could work on the frame much easier, um, things like that. Nothing like working on Airstream and listening to the VAP. Well, we had our second day of uh, light showers. Uh, these 60s models, the C-channel just sits on top in 70s models and later um, your subfloor would actually go inside part of the C-channel. Uh, so it would look like this. This year model literally just sits on top. So um, a lot easier. So yeah, it's easier. Um, it just literally goes on top. Um, this is 5 eighths, 5 eighths. 5 eighths inch subfloor um, this year model or 1930 seconds um, whatever you can grab at your hardware store Zach said if I want this project done in the time frame that I was thinking that I had to get my hands dirty so here goes nothing Also, what I'm gonna do, because like I said, these tanks are four inches uh, tall. This frame is four inches tall. What I'm gonna do to protect myself from doing something goofy. Once I get these tanks in here, I bought a 16 gauge flat steel uh, sheet, and I'm going to weld it over these tanks so that if I happen to try to drill a screw in to, uh, to tie down like a cabinet, things like that, any kind of framing, I won't go through these tanks and neither will anybody else in the future. So that's what I'm going to do. getting all the surface rust off that I could, reinforcing, um, adding supports here and there. As you can see, I went around the edges, added supports. I welded supports all the way around um, for the floor plan that we have in mind. Welded the flat plate, flat sheet in to cover the tanks. I made a spare tire carrier to mount up front. Um, it is removable, as you can see. I'm by, I tapped the frame, and so you'll remove the bolts, and then it's removable, so if someone doesn't want it, um, or if they want to have a storage box up here, whatever. But so, goes up there. So for next week, we might have a surprise for you guys. Circumstances arise, you just gotta go with the flow. That's all that said, guys. Stay steady. <laughs> 